All right, welcome back. Here's another video for you. In today's video, I'm going to just uh, show you how I do the applic application of paintable caulking and also silicone. So the paintable caulking, I will use around uh, the wood baseboard uh, casing and uh, fill in any of the, the gaps that you'll see after it's painted. I usually just put a little bit and then smooth it out with my finger and do that everywhere. Um, I like to keep some paper towel handy just to put the excess into and then you can discard that. So you want to go with a really decent paintable caulking. Uh, don't go cheap on that. It's well worth it to uh, to spend the money and, and get a good uh, caulking tube because um, like you want to get something that is flexible, um, doesn't shrink, and is very durable. So you want it to last for as long as possible. The silicone as well. Now the silicone I will put around the shower and also I will put it um, around the vanity top. So I think that's pretty much all I want to mention for now. Um, if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. I'm going to probably just add some music and uh, you can just uh, see the visual on how I go about doing the caulking. So the caulking will be first, the paintable caulking around all the trim, and then after that I'm going to show you how I um, apply it around the shower in this bathroom and also around the vanity top. Um, silicone is always better to use where there will be water. Um, it just, uh, it'll, it's a, it's a much better um, thing to use to seal up gaps along along those areas. All right, so I hope you enjoy. If you do like the video, uh, leave a thumbs up. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, I do appreciate all my subscribers. I'm almost at 2,000 now, and I'm very th thankful and happy for that. Uh, so uh, yeah, keep watching and enjoy upcoming videos in the future. And uh, yeah, leave your comments and questions below. I always appreciate the feedback. And uh, yeah, have a good day. Thanks.